Yo, hello there, my delicious friends. It's your boy, Mikey Mega Mega, live on Twitch for another episode of Let's Play Horizon Zero Dawn. We are smashing through this game. Look at my beautiful glinting armor and my beautiful, hopeful future. We are just going to do this little semi-side mission where we find the dude's sister with some help of the king, which is going to free up this entire Sun Dynasty to help us with the end part of the game, the attack on Hades. And uh, the attempt to stop him from using the Spire to activate all the evil machines in the world to wipe the slate clean. As such, we are vibing along live on twitch.tv forward slash Mikey Mega Mega. Or maybe you guys are watching the VOD on YouTube, in which case, hello there. Thank you so much. Click like and subscribe so you can keep up with every episode. It's lovely to have you. All these other supplicants, not actually important to me. Oh, I thought he was just about to leave the line. She just stepped out for no reason. Right, guys, we're going to meet these guys at... Oh, Jesus! <laughs> we're we're going, I guess we're going all the way up here. Oh, God damn it, Kyle. My, my nearest bonfire is here. Sorry, I'm burping and chewing and all sorts of stuff. I have a fresh cup of tea. We are trying to complete this game as quickly as possible, so we're focusing on our main missions only. I have some delicious juice. And we now have to find something to mount and ride so we can go all the way up to Pitchcliffe. Uh, why? What's that got to do with anything? Talk to Murad, follow Murad, and meet with Murad's operative. It appears that Eren's sister Ursa was kidnapped instead of slain. But many questions remain. Where is she? Who is responsible? Why did they do it? Right, so this is the operative we're going to meet up with for some info. Good to know. Right. Well, off we go, my friends. We have... Oh, God, I should have bought a load of potions. Tits. I forgot to purchase lots and lots of potions. Right, if we see any wild animals, we have to kill them immediately. I need to get my sweet hands on lots of fatty meats, if possible. There's more animals on the side of the water that has green shrubbery. So I'm just going to cross over. Will keep. Mike, you need to go to sleep too. No, I'm okay, man. I work up really, really late. And my game plan is to try to complete this game tonight. Uh... I kind of assumed I had maybe one or two missions to do. I feel like we're about to do the final mission. But it's just kind of suddenly hit me with this submission that we've got to get out of the way first. It won't let me actually move on to the main quest until we get this one done. So this might just eat into a Let's Play episode. Just a little bit. But we'll be alright. You guys have to keep me awake. Good for an old remedy. I'll plug in my um, love sense thing so that any tips and donos uh, vibrate me for 15 seconds. Oh no, sorry, wrong live stream. That's a different website. Just talk to me in chat, that'll do. Okay, some fatty meat. Good, but not enough. All pigs must die. Kill, oh man. It's so political. As long as I'm vaguely heading in the right direction as well. Oh, there's some more uh, turtle boys. Could I not spare the weight for anything? Let me just craft. What did I not have enough weight for just then? The shard salvage skill allows you to disassemble resources. It does, but what was it that I was full of? Turkey bones. Hmm. Hey, that's what it was for. Uh, resources satchel. Ooh. Oh, I can't upgrade that anymore. Hmm. 
Okay, cool. Anyway. Oh, what's this? Just got back. No, I don't, I'm not really bothered about any more of the data points regarding the old world. We don't really need to paint a picture of what the old world was like anymore because we now know what happened to it. So if there's any in-game plot specific audio shards, sure. Everything else now is just excess. Uh, I'm not going to fight these guys. It's, there's no point. I can't ride them. And uh, none of them are going to give me any fatty meat. So I'm just going to follow the path around the uh, shoreline. Handsome Bill, how you doing, man? Came back right on tits. Hey! Lovely to have you. Is there a campfire? Log a quick save. How are you guys all doing? Has anybody got any plans for the weekend? Anything fun happening in your lives? God damn it. I can carry so many resources now, it's amazing. Yo! Oh no, these are problematic. But I can fuck them up real quick. Okay, only from a distance though. I was hoping I'd be able to do something really impressive with my new spear. With my Lance Reddick Lance. My Lance Reddick! <gasps> I just got it! I just got it! He gave me a Lance Reddick. Right. Right, okay, okay, okay. Anyway, uh, sorry, the only reason I investigated is because I thought they might have been horses. Pseudo horses. But they're not. <laughs> oh, Josh, how are you, man? Josh! I forgot bits had sounds low low. Thank you very much for the 500 bitties. Oh, I was all right with that one. I was able to manage myself. How are you, dude? How are you? Dude, thank you. Was that because I realized the amazing Lance reference? Better than Lance Hendrickson. Lance Hendrickson, uh, he'll be in anything. Old Lancey. Sir Lancelot. Beans and rice, yo. Stodgy dreams. What types of beans? I've got tea and chocolate. A can-do attitude. And a song in my heart. Everything a grown man needs. Hey, these ones... We can mount. Now, I should be slightly better at sneaking. Nice. Okay. Follow the river. Oh, 
Oh, can I shoot from uh, horseback? Oh. Yo. That'll keep my stomach quiet. Good. Oh, this one's still investigating. I'm so much more stealthy in this outfit. Okay, I don't want to hang out here because of those assholes. Did I get that boar meat though? I did, okay. Let's not linger. Although I do now have enough to make hopefully some more potions. Okay, let's go. I'm trying to keep my bits number at 69k. Thank you very much for the posture check. I will. Oh, hello. No, no, no. What the hell? Get off. What are you doing? Oh, that was really weird. I should be able to do all of that from horseback kill the animal and also pick up the uh, materials but if you don't press it right it gets really dodgy you keep jumping on and off oh those guys down there oh should we test out that burning thing you guys were talking about the other day oh no i better not if i start what are those things what are those They're like giant iguanodons. Oh, they're those sand salamander things. The ones that kept going underground. They're actually a nightmare. I don't want to mess with that cheese. Uh, yo, I'm just going to eat some ant... Uh, are they coming closer? Uh, they're not I think his territory is on the other side of the river I don't think he's going to come towards me Okay Should we just go Should we just go We've learned enough We have learned enough Good knowledge. Has it ever occurred to you to use some cable ties on those exposed wires? On these exposed wires? I have cable I These cable ties? What are you talking about? If you're talking about this, it's literally cable tied. Well, sorry, not cable tied. Those little twisties. Right, is this a bandit camp? Or a good guy camp? Okay, they're good guys. Yeah. They're Kaja! Uh, is there a trader here? Um, I might just pop up here just so I can sell and buy some items real quick. Oh, is this where I'm supposed to go anyway? Oh, maybe I'm in the right place. Any Aloy fan art plans for the future? Not yet, Suture. I mean, yes in general. I like the idea, but I haven't come to any actual sketches yet or anything. I've still three other pieces I want to do after my dress-up darling. No sign of Marat's guy. He's had plenty of time to investigate. We'd better look for him. On your mount! Damn right. You ruined the joke. 
Oh, I'm so sorry, Eva. I'm so sorry, Eva. Forget about him. Where's my stuff? How's that wrestling arm of yours? Right. Uh, you don't have enough metal shards. Oh, I've only got 31 shards. I'm used to being rich. No, I'm not doing much crafting at the moment, guys. And I'm not doing any more purchasing. So I will sell a lot of my stuff now. How do I change its sorting? I've sorted it by rarity, but I don't know how I've actually done that. Oh, options. Options. Oop. Ah. Ah. Ooh, popularity. What? The... Which one of these was I? Uh... Do I... Anyway, anything that's just crafting and trading, I'll do. Because I don't need to do much trading. I won't. Fe I, won I won't mess around with any of my meat, though. Uh, oh, I need that for crafting arrows. Okay, well, I don't wanna, I don't want to fuck around with arrow crafting, just for trading and selling. Okay, here we go. It's for screen nonsense. Right, here we go. Sorry. Okay, now I have money. Health boost and just health boost and full health potions. Loads of anti-freeze and anti-shock. Couple resisto fires. Just keep spending that money. She's too pure. I don't think she's as pure as you think. Not when I draw her. Uh, we will do. Yeah, I'm down for it. I'm down for it. But I just I wanted. We haven't even. I haven't even started sketching out my Dark Souls thing yet. So what are we doing? Find the operative. Oh, okay. Is it you? Is it you? I've had about enough of the car job. Thinking about heading back to plane. Adam? I'm ground down to the bone. No iron spatter. I they did make two of you. Right, it's just in this area. I've got to find them. Oh, how gently annoying. So I just have to keep starting conversations. Awesome, don't always take kindly with strangers. Keep that in mind. I'm not trading today. Fire and spit. What do you want? There's like three people who live here. Cardman? One sec. We don't need Mikey looking like part of that Smurf Bukake. Yeah, yeah, we're not coming back to that. Wait, I haven't died at all. I haven't, I haven't died once today. 
we've come pretty close. We got into some sticky situations, but I did really well. Oh, here we go. Here's some people. Smoke and sweat. That's how you know you've done a good day's work. Oh, that's where I was a minute ago. Oh. 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 Oh, it's bigger up here. Oh. You look fresh from the forge. Ah. Ooh. More tracks. I think someone followed whoever we're following. That sounds bad. Oh no. Has to be Marat's guy. Durval's thugs must have made him. Maybe because he found something. Look at this. I think he drew a map with his own blood. Right. Those kind of maps you know you better follow. That might be Pitchcliff. He marked a spot to the north. Could be Durval's location. And my men are waiting outside of town. I'll grab them and meet you there. Wow, not even a moment spared for the poor operative who used the last of their life's energy not in selfish sucker, but to advise those that he was working for. He doesn't even have a name. Osam's already forgotten that he was even there. It's not much the life of an agent. You have to do it because you believe in something that's bigger than yourself, I guess. That's what they tell you when you're young. Okay, so we're going to go 300 blue peter meters up into the camp. Do I still have my robo horse? Goat Tillion. Yeah, there he is. My precious steed! He kicks up a fuss whenever I put him down a hill. But he will go. Or she. Oh my god, come on. There we go. Hmm, it's kind of rusty. <laughs> for the trail. Imagine the intricacies of drawing that. Of drawing a... what? I'm new to the term of femboy, so I expected like a fetish. You've never heard of femboy before? Femboy is like the anti-tom girl, right? No, for every tomboy there's a fem girl. Wait, no, for every tomboy there's a femboy. Is that what we're... Is this... Is this a path? I'm not convinced this is faster. Glad they're waterproof. They're very loud. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> he just leapt away from me for that cutscene. I guess we're here. Oh, he's going in about me. Oh, wow. They've chained them up. Machines. Looks like they've been chained up. No shit. Durval's a tinker. He probably experiments on them all. Strips them for parts. Should I Google Sibia now? Now is the time. I'll go in first. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right, we've got your back. 
Okay, right. It's been a while since we've done this, guys. An opportunity to do stealth kills. I dare say we can release these animals and it will cause some kind of ruckus. Oh, did that not hit its target? Duval's men. Oh, well, sorry, guys. So much for sneaking up. Intruders! Unleash the machines! Shoot their chains! Oh, no! Oh, don't do that. That's the opposite of what I was hoping for. I really wish I'd done this differently. Sorry, guys. Is this gun anywhere? Yep, here we go. Remember, first things first. Grab the gun. Oh, that's not a gun. Oh, there's no... There's no Robogun. The whole point of my venture was Robogun. Oh, there it is. Found it. Right. Okay, now we are cooking with some actual cheese. Good. Right. I can't even tell which ones are on my side. Okay, good bit of massacring. I think that's helped the odds somewhat. I shall take your shards. If you can't sneak and get loads of really uh, satisfying stealth kills, then you can at least grab a massive gun and have some fun. No shame in taking cover. She, she's just walking. Look at that. There's no shame in taking cover. Dude, we're in the middle of a battle. Oh, oh, she's, I thought she was on my side. She literally just talked to me. A minute ago, she was like, there's no shame in taking cover. We were having a conversation. I don't know about these people. It's, wait, is anybody on my side? Where's all my people? This is why we have loads of health potions. Wait, he's on my side. That's my dude, isn't it? Oh, it's her health bar. Wait, is he down? Is he dead? Like for... Oh, I was so confused. I had no idea who was who. Right. Well, that was... Uh... We've got to get this side mission out of the way as quickly as possible. I'm so sorry. Let's pause it. Let me just do uh, the death markings. Yo, have you done it? Kitty, have you finished your studies? Ooh, ah. Old man noises for some leaning down. Yo, Kitty, welcome back. What did you learn today in school? It's rather battle royale. Yeah, it's an absolute shit show. Mm -hmm. You look so handsome with your face paint. Oh, thank you very much. You're rather gorgeous yourself. Let's go over here. This face paint kit's super cheap on Amazon, but I'm just smashing through all the blue. Uh, guys, in Horizon Forbidden West, what colour is she? Is she still using blue colour schemes? Or is it green or is it red? I saw green and red and I don't know what's what.
Yeah, there we go. I've marked for passing of Aloy. But now we will lead ourselves to victory, so fear not, my friends. This one is ours. Okay. This time with more sneaking than ever before. Can I do like a ledge? No. Uh, oh. Hello. I'm still going to go through the front with the rest of them because I want that power weapon. Let me just make sure I've got my um, increased health and my potions lined up. But I'm going to run through the front. Oh, I didn't think it would actually... Uh... I thought I was going to somehow get like a uh, a critical hit on the chicken. That did not happen. So now I've actually got to fight the chicken. I should have left it well alone, but I didn't. Wow. That bad, huh? Now they're all going to war inside. I think my main guy can actually die. I'm not sure. And as far as these guys are concerned, I want that gun right there. But I do appreciate now. Uh, oh, wow. What was that? Kind of hoping this beast would uh Ooh, also attack the dudes. I think all my friends are dead. Because all the rest have stopped fighting. 
That is fascinating. Maybe all of my team are out. Oh no, there we go. He's still there. The guy with a loaf of bread above his head is on my side. But I think all the other NPCs that went in with us didn't make it. Now, where's that gun? Here we go. This is why we're doing it, guys. This is why. Good lad. Yeah, everybody else is dead. Not good on board. Really? Isn't he a loaf? Because you're yeast friends. You're yeast friends. You could have at least tried to get... We've got a quaking. Who are you talking to? You could have said... You could have said they might not be useful, but they've got the bread sign, so you know at yeast you're still friends. It was the best of times. It was the yeast of times. I don't know. I'm trying to work with you here, Josh. But, uh, you know, you've, you're building your foundations on sandy ground here. It's lucky I don't judge. Oh, is, this, is he okay? Go on now. So I guess he, he can get knocked, but he doesn't really die. I wonder if we're going to get there too late and his sister would have been murdered like just an hour ago or something. The blood will still be warm. Yo, give me your gun. Give me your gun. Oh, this one's not falling over. My favourite part of the game is when I'm stuck on items or walls. Oh good, dick chicken. It's the chicken you love to hate. We're getting there. I don't know what sarcasm tastes like. It's uh, salty. But I'll drink loads of pineapple juice. Not bad. Right, give me that big gun. If we're going deeper into enemy territory, give me the big gun. The only reason I freed that monster was for the gun fun. 
I'm not having much luck with these blast traps. And those monsters now, up up in this area, I guess because they're angrier, because they were tortured, or they're stronger, they don't get automatically dropped or staggered by those electric tripwires. My turn. Which is kind of the only way to deal with them. Right, where are we going? Don't drop it! That door better stay open. If you shut that door behind you and I don't get my gun, I'm going to be really annoyed. Oh, they've tinkered booby traps with animal heads. Your boss says you gotta eat dirt. No, get the gun! Get the, the big gun! So they woke up. Ah, earplugs. They must use these to protect themselves from that awful sound. No eat, just swallow. Just swallow. Just be a good girl. <laughs> Just swallow, no eat. Only no eat, only swallow. Where's that angry kitten meme? Mm. Oh, disable for sonic barrier. Oh. Oh, I guess he doesn't have a pair of earplugs. She must be deaf or dead. What a horrible torture. Aaron? Durval tried to break me. Shows what he knows. I, sh I should have been with you. Why didn't you come for me? I, I know I'm a useless trunk, but... No, idiot. I got a message from Durval saying he wanted to parlay. I didn't come for you because I knew it was a trap. I couldn't let you get hurt. I just didn't think it'd be that good. At Surely that. she'd just be like, Thought what? I, <laughs> I know I'm a useless <laughs> drunk. Why didn't you take me with you? <coughs> what? <laughs> now listen, Durval's planning something big in Meridian. He said he'd force Avad to watch as the smoke darkens their precious sun. Hmm. Your king needs you. No more playing around. You're gonna have to grow up fast. I, I will. I promise. You damn well better, little brother. Ursa. No, no. Please. <laughs> I won't let you down. I promise. Aaron died. That was convenient. I'm so sorry. You've got to find Durval. But Meridian's a big place. I'll, uh, I'll look through his things. Maybe we can narrow it down. Yeah, she died anyway. 
I guess they had a render of the sound thing for an incredibly long time. That is a horrible way to die. What happens when I turn it on? I think I've got it working. There. Now, say something. Both of you doves. I don't know. What do you want me to say? Whatever you want. I, I just want to hear your voice. Keep it for later. I'll sing, Papa. La 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 la. <laughs> that, sounds, that sounds like somebody pretending to be a child. That doesn't sound like a kid. That sounds like a creepy adult. There. A song and a laugh. Even better than words. This machine's been picked apart with precision. What's Durval learned from all his tinkering? Do I even want to know? Such a strange device. It's beautifully crafted. Just notes about crafting. Oh, and a letter tucked between the pages. Lots of blaze. Headed to Meridian. If we find it, I'll bet we find her vault too. <sighs> Are there two bad guys over there? But haven't been triggered. Wait, where's he gone? Oh, he's here. I think I found something that can help. Let's head back to the palace. Go. I won't be long, but I need to tend to my sister. Just give me some time with Ursa. Right, let's go. <clears throat> the sun shall fall. Quest menu. Uh, Deval kidnaps and tortured Ursa, who later died of her wounds. Yes, that was just now. Let's go and get him before he takes revenge on the Kaja. He must be stopped at all costs. Sure thing. It's heavy. Going right. Oh, it's just those two animals. Uh, I'm going to fast travel back then. Quick sec. Fuck you. Wait, can I fast travel with this? Yo, let's fast travel all the way back. Does this gun come with me? That, my friends, detective, is the right question. Hmm. <clears throat> that was a waste of time. I know. <laughs> Never gonna give you up. Come on, let's go. Oh, this side mission is just such a stick in the side. No pun intended. When we want to just be cracking on and fighting the robot Hades, but I've got to get involved in this melodramatic pseudo revenge coup bloodline plot in order to free these guys up. It didn't come with me. Oh, that is a shame. Um, I. But we work hard as any I could do with a map, to be honest, on my screen. Not just going into like when I'm in this area, I'm a little bit turned around. I guess the waypoints at the very top, that kind of compass thing, is good enough. Let's go see the Sun King. Everybody loves the fun king. What the hell have you done, king? Real little lady dum king. You gotta get good if you want him to come with you. Alright, alright, full key. 
Bloody hell. Go with her. It's family stream. I've had my fun. And that's all for martyrs. I've sent a messenger to the claim to let everyone know. If there's anything you or your clan need for her arrangements, you need but ask. There'll be time for all of that later. Aloy. What I tell him is, you were masturbating before you met me, you can masturbate after. I've had my fun, and that's all that matters. Hashtag thank you for the sex. I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about Ursa. To learn she lives, then lose that hope seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun. Oh, pragmatic. Tell him what you found in his papers. It's a race. Letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. The name was Ayland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across it's the city, him. including one under that name. He's the Eamon Foreman. It's by the edge of the Mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Aaron, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Alive? Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious. Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Nope, I don't care. Consider that a command. I do <sighs> not care. You're commanding him, but you're not hey, commanding me. A moment, please. Main game, main quest, come on. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? Yeah, horribly. Horribly. She thought of you. She didn't mention your name once. Wait, were you two dating? I didn't even realize they were going out. This isn't a time, mate. No, I'll ask this one. She's not the one who's suffering now. You are. She died before you could say goodbye. Is it that obvious? You're right. I'm dwelling on my pain, not just hers. And there's only one thing left that can help. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. This is where we remind him of Aphrodite. Oh, okay. But once this threat to Meridian is dealt with, another one looms. Dickhead. We have to talk about the Eclipse. We will. I promise. Alright. Let's go, let's go. Talk to Avad. Whatever you say, boss. Oh, all the way back around here, yeah? Right, give me 15 minutes to cross the bridge. Have you ever thought of moving your temple just a little bit closer to that campfire? You'd say it's, it's like getting to a boss in Dark Souls. 20 minutes travel time. <sighs> Thank you for joining me this evening. Let's have a chat. No, a colorful discussion. Preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. <laughs> this is the place. You home, Durval? I got a surprise for you. Wow, he's really good with that door kick. That's like his thing. Wildfire. I'll get my flame arrows out. Is it a bomb? Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. 
Uh, oh, I really want to go to that campfire, and but I want to turn around and I want to blow up that building. So let me just really quickly save. Let me get a cheeky quick save in here. Oh, I didn't... Oh, wow! This one's... Are they, this one's floating off the floor slightly. That's amazing. Oh, That's really cool. Oh no, where is... Uh, getting turned around again. How do I get to the bonfire? Oh god, I'm turned around. How do I get down? Oh god, I hate this place. Alright, I have to go this way, right? To get into the main bit, to get down here. He's the only true faithful one. He's ascended. He's far beyond anything they could have dreamed. Hey, here we go. Oh, it's a brazier. All right, thanks for bearing with. I just wanted to get that out of the way because I don't want to go through all that discussion bullshit again. But I do want to mess up the vibe and see if I can shoot... Oh my god, where did, I just, where did I come from? Was there a staircase here a minute ago? Yes! Uh, yes! Uh, uh. So there was a good devotee look. Uh, where have I got him for Mikey playthrough? So Lair was my boy. I will always miss him. Corruption all across the... That was a true tale of sadness. My boy So Lair. Oh, that reminds me. I've got a twister ice lolly downstairs. Okay, so. Flame arrow. Oh, what? After all that... It doesn't even have an effect. I don't know what everyone's worried about. Right, what am I doing up here? Examine the bomb. If that bomb goes off, the blaze will ignite in a firestorm. No, it won't. It looks like a wooden bracket. It's immune to fire. Not very strong. Help me push this out. What am I doing? Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. Wait, is this a good idea? What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is going to get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Uh, people live down there, don't they? Wait, so instead of blowing up one house, you risk we blowing up the entire foundations. Best shot. The Meridian's still standing. This is over. Duval said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. And that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Duval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. Should try out for the live action One Piece and be so <laughs> Why would you say that, Crusher? Finished. Well, Zora's a little bit shorter and browner than I remember. He's put on some weight. Doesn't appear to know how to wield swords. Alright, well, we did a thing. Nobody cares. What have I got to do? Investigate the local area. With just a bit of blaze in them. Oh, I hate these tracking following missions. Do you know what I mean? All of this kind of stuff is just like video game bullshit. But I'm not choosing. 
I don't mind it a little bit when it leads into the plot, but I'm constantly, the entire time we're doing this, I'm constantly reminded that this is side story that I'm being forced to do by the game just in order to complete the main quest. Another one of Durval's hideouts. <laughs> oh. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. Oh. Durval did find a way into the palace. Oh no. <gasps> I don't know what he looks like. I've never seen that guy before in my life. Yo, am I climbing? Bloody hell. Everybody in this game is physically hyper capable when it comes to running and jumping. Let's go. Oh, health potion. Can't even take it. But I will have those mushrooms. Thank you. These will keep. Okay, lovely. Up here. Oh, that's a lot of mushrooms. I'm probably about to get into a big fight. I'm loving the army you have on. Yo, thank you very much. It looks so good in all weather conditions and all cutscenes. I had a car just set on earlier, but I think this is the one I'm probably playing till endgame. Look at you, Avad. The wriggling runt of a maniac king. You robbed me of my right to kill your father. Ooh. So I'll have to settle for you. I'm going to enjoy watching the Karja burn. Even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian Avad. Breathe in the stench. And choke on the ashes. Something's wrong. It didn't... I, I didn't hear anything. There's a bit of smoke rising from the mesa's edge. No! It should be a firestorm, <laughs> not some belt from a charcoal burner. Hey, there's some smoke. I think you did really well. No! I wanted a big bomb. Big bada boom. No That's weird. Oh. Hmm. Old records. I'm not going to read that. Your ways of thinking are out of date anyway. Defeat Darvel and his men. You're just going to lie there, yeah? 
Alright, you don't look like you're having a good day, to be fair. You all look a bit fucked. Alright, I'll do it. What's this? Oh. You must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp. And disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well. I don't care for the helm. No I thought it was too much at first. That with but blood. then I remembered first it's it's yours, then it's the armor cybernetic version of having a skull on your head, right? Having like a ram skull armor. She's just got like some cyber bird head. She's here. Mm -hmm. Why does a bard always have his lady? It's not over yet, Nora. What's that? Here? Any good Osaram Tinker will tell you. Always have a third plan. Oh, 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 oh,
Wait, are they infinite? Are they just going to keep coming? Am I supposed to do something a bit more clever? Assuming this is the last one or right, wrong thing. Was it? Okay, good. Oh, what a mare. I was well stocked with potions, so I could kind of just take all the hits I needed to for the sake of getting that done, but yeesh. Looks good. Okay, so where's the dude? Where is the dude? I wish Ursa was here to kill you. I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Eren, you'll screw it up. <laughs> I know what you are afraid of. Smashing his knees. Going back to mainspring in chains. Smash his knees Every in. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now. Oops. Smash one of his knees at least. He killed your sister. He tortured your sister. Like when we did that mission, that was weeks ago. He tortured your sister for weeks with using sound. She was straitjacketed and she slowly hemorrhaged to death. You've got a massive hammer. At least smash his knees in. Ah, this is some PG bullshit right here. All right, let's get out of here. Are we done? Are we done? Can I now fucking do the main mission? Yo, uh, quests, main quest. The Looming Shadow. Oh, no, we still got to do this one. All right. Wrap up, I guess. Just closure. Please, I, I need a moment to gather myself. I believe Aaron wants to speak to you. You. Fine, Aaron. Hey, what's up? Aloy. I was just thinking about Ursa. We crave violence. She would have killed Durval on the spot. PG I bullshit know. makes no sense. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place, to put him down. Yeah, do bear bidding for you, says the guy who called in the machines in the first place. I gotta admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do. Right? <laughs> you're asking me? I'm pretty sure you're older. <laughs> All right. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? Young at heart. Did with Young at don't heart. Give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't, because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. See ya. Well. I know. You gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master. All before breakfast. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. And now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Aww. Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. 
I hate to tell you this after everything you've been through, but there's another fight brewing, and I need your help. Helis and his fanatics are coming from Iridian. Well, no rest for the weary, huh? Well, don't worry. I'll be there for you. Yo, come on. He's cute, isn't he? He's like, now that he's grown as a person, he's actually had a bit of a character arc. Aloy, to say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. No, Eli, there's not been much romancing. You saved my life. I thought there was going to be you saved between Meridian. him and, because and you, the guy back at the Nora tribe, the son of the warrior priestess but lady. Warn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. Avad, stop. There's something urgent we have to... I know, but please, just listen for a moment. I want you to stay in Meridian. What? Why? Well, to start with, you kept the city from going up in flames. You're strong, shrewd, uh, capable. I could use someone like you at my side. Yeesh. Yeah, like you used Ursa. I'm not some substitute for that woman you miss. Uh, <laughs> do you know what? I'm going to go in hard. I'm going to slap this boy down, even though I diplomatically do need his help in the upcoming war against machines. Only five minutes ago, I told you that your girlfriend was dead, so I'm not into it. Let me get this straight. Your warrior princess is barely cold in her grave, and you're lining me up to take her place? What? No, sun and shadow, that's not what I meant. All right, I, I can see how my choice of words came off as presumptuous, but I meant no disrespect. By the sun, this is not how I imagined this conversation would go. Let's just forget this ever happened. You had something urgent to discuss? <laughs> wow, that was so awkward. Yo. Helis is preparing to attack Meridian. It could come at any time. By the sun. Wait a moment. I want Murad to hear this. Aloy, the Sun King tells me that you bring grave news. Please. Was he just standing in the know. corner? Helis commands a legion of fanatics called the Eclipse. They will attack soon from the west with an army of ancient war machines. Oh my god. But that's not the worst of it. No. They'll bring a mind with them. God, demon, machine. Whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it. And have the City Guard fortify the Western Ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight, where the Spire rests. Now. It will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. Everything. I don't know about everything, but I'll tell you what I can. Oh, thank God that faded to black. I was just like, how long do I have to sit here and listen to this? Finally, we've done all that side beeswax. My friends, I have four skill points to unlock. And I'm going to be having a little play of that after I go for a quick wee. And I will see you in a quick moment. I'll hit some of you guys with an advert so that it's not shoveled down your throats automatically by the Twitch gods. One quick moment. Oh, okay, yo. Something tells me that we're not going to finish this game tonight. All of that having to just do this side mission was just like completely killed the momentum of us vibing along. I mean, we're finally done. Oh, but now we've got to go all the way over here. Talk to Murad for Blameless. Why? I don't even know who that is. Quietly better. Oh, this guy. In the city will only create another enemy. 
and do keep me appraised of each new arrival. Hello. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the ridge defense. From fires to autoerotic asphyxiation. Word was sent to every so much for feet. Our allies offered their steel. Who's that guy who, uh... Others for shards. But the guy from Kill Bill, who... By name. For me. Don't be so humble. What happens now? I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at evening sign report there's still no... Been too long since I used that command. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere... Oh, cheers, Bill. Thank you. Time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. You can sleep there, if sleep comes. Okay, great. So, now what? Uh, I've got optionals. And then rest before the final battle. Do, do, do rest before the final battle. Right, the final battle. Okay, we might actually be at the end of the game. Yo, so Olin's house is now my house. Oh yeah, his wife and children are still captured and missing. <laughs> It's not even worth recovering time, his family. Commander? If I bring back his wife and his kids, all they're going to do is want to live in the house. But that house has been given to me. If I can find it, that is. Where am I going? It's just running me round in circles. Oh, here we go. Olin's apartment feels empty. Should I sleep? Did I leave anything unfinished? Let's uh, sort out our kit. Mm hmm. Okay, nice. Right. Let's go to bed. David Carradine. Ah, ye. Ah, ye. Mm hmm. Do you know how to use this bed? Hello? There we go. Rest before the battle. No way back. Uh, so, guys, is, does anybody know if this is the last battle in the game? I might Google it really quickly. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn chapters. The reason why I ask this is because I'm quite tired. So this is our last play. We've got 40 minutes left in this episode. So if this is the final battle, what I'll do is I'll go check out the DLC. We'll go into the other section of the map really quickly and take a look. And then I'll do the final battle tomorrow with you guys. Before we start the sequel. Ah, so what is the vibe? Uh, the mountain that fell? I think we did that one. The looming shadow. What's this one? Ah, oh, so the optional bits allow you to talk to the different people who are coming to aid you in your battle. But I don't understand. Okay, here we go. After completing this mission, you automatically have to do the next mission, the Face of Extinction. You cannot free roam, so be well prepared. Right, this is it. So this is the last opportunity. Okay, let's do some more prep. Good to know. Sock in a jar, thank you very much. So this is... Yo! He's studying us. Oh my goodness. Secret Moonshine, hey yeah. How you doing? Welcome back, welcome back. Oh, welcome on in, Raiders. How's life treating you? Dude, how are you getting on, man? Uh, welcome on in. We are just... Ew. We are just vibing along to... Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. If I seem like I'm out of it, it's because I'm rather sleepy. It's now 3.42 in the morning. Uh, we've just gotten to the bit where it's your last opportunity to save the game 
before the final battle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and drop a manual save by the fire pit. Even though I have no idea how to find any location in this goddamn city. We're going to do a manual save. And then we're going to take a look at the free roaming and the DLC. And then we're going to complete this game tomorrow. Cold oatmeal. How you doing, dude? Secret Moonshine, is it you who um, uh, got the job? You fi am I... Dude, my memory is completely scatty. Especially this late. But dude, am I right in thinking you uh, finished your studies and uh, you also have employment? Gainfully employed. Mm, yes. Congratulations. You, you might do. Come here if you will. What are you doing on your stream? Video games? Pokemon? Yeah, there it is. Get the cover. Let this... Yo, let's go. Right, manual. I've never seen... I've never done a manual save in this game in my life. Here we go, new save game. Okay, so... What I'll be able to do then is we can come back to this whenever needs be. So let's review the preparations at the ridge. We might as well have a look. These are two optional ones. And after we've looked at those two... Then we can go check out the DLC area up here. Lovely jubbly. Where are they coming from? I just what had an audio problem. Were you asking what I was streaming? You're back on Dark Souls. I'm in the nasty swamp and I don't like it. Blight Town and the disgusting swamp area. I hate that area so much. Yeah, no, dude, I was just saying, uh, you know, congratulations on uh, being gainfully employed and finishing your studies. Wish you all the best for the future. I also wish you all the best for Blight Town. But that place sucks. It sucks. I'm so sick of this. I hate this city. I never know how to get out of it. All I ever do is fast travel to another campfire because <laughs> it's easier. Uh, okay, forward here and then down here? Oh, there's two bridges and I take the one on the right. Okay, got it. What's happening? Is the battle starting? We are on the eve of war. But I don't mind. Is this a lift? Ah. Oh, I see. Starting your new job in a couple of weeks. You're awesome, dude. Dude, thank you very much for raiding in. I hope you enjoyed any other part of Dark Souls that wasn't Blight Town. Ay, caramba. There are a few other areas that are also nightmares in the crypts. But other than that, the rest of Dark Souls is way more fun. No, this is the previous one. Uh, it looks brilliant for a five-year-old game. I guess we're kind of starting to plateau with technology and graphics. But um, I hope to complete this tonight so we could play the new one tomorrow. Because I think it's coming in a post. However, we're not going to finish it tonight. I'm too shattered. But we are, like I say, about to do the final chapter if we want to. So I'm going to do a little bit of running around tonight and exploring. And then tomorrow evening I'll do another stream. We'll finish this game and then possibly start the next one. Her hair looks like it's in water. The floating mechanics on her hair have like a lag. That's so weird. Unless that's supposed to be wind. Okay, lovely. Very mechanical. Very impressive. Okay, where are we going? Uh, the nearest one is this one. Yep. My family might still be alive. And you're I'm going super to stand enjoying. here and do nothing? We've lost a dozen patrols beyond the valley. Our orders are clear. I'm avoiding all of these side missions. Otherwise, we'll never get anything done. I'm enjoying it so far. It's getting brutal. I've been waiting to play this game. It seems like it could take a long time to beat, so I've been anxious. Dude, I've been focusing mostly on the main plot. I started playing this on Monday, and we are on the last mission on Thursday night. So... I'd say I've put in about uh, wait was it 10 five episodes and then another six episodes 
So I've put in 22 hours. If you just want to do the main plot, 22 hours will get you up to the last chapter. So let's say just a solid 24. Sun King doesn't mean he's any less but guilty. if you actually are uh, someone who enjoys exploring like I normally am, then yeah, you'll be playing this game for an incredibly long time, no doubt. Yo, so what are the defenses like? Also, I see you have a massive gun. Where's Petra? Oh, yes, my Nora dude. Aloy, I told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds even had time to heal? Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other Nora at the Spire. Mm. I brought supplies instead. Aww. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster, whatever that means. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of Yeesh. arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy, when you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. The Osram have gone too far oh. this time. Draval should die for his crimes. So, we're gonna have a fight on this front. Probably of loads of Kaja and robot dinosaurs. So that's gonna be pretty tough. Should I clear this area of all the native wildlife so that they don't become corrupted? That might be a good idea. Where am I supposed to go? Have I, have, wait, have I still not done the review part? I don't understand what it wants me to do. Do I have to scan it? Training dummy, yeah. So? I don't really understand the nature of what's being asked of me here. How much of a side quest had? Shed loads. As far as useful items and things? Dude, no, no idea, man. Um, I have... Right, now there, there is side quest armor that you have to work very hard for. This armor that I've got here is pretty hardcore. Um, my bow has a load of options in terms of like the different ways it affects machinery. I've got really good traps. This is all just from the main quest. Um, doo -doo -doo, hello. So there's loads of outfits, but basically most of the things, you need a few items that you get from killing dinosaur robots, but most of the stuff you can buy. However, when it comes to side quests, I haven't done barely anything, but there's they're already logging up. There's all sorts. There's loads of families of issues. It's like a, it's like The Witcher. Everyone's got something they want you to do. Errands, gathering ancient materials from the before times, fashion, war, combat, gladiatorial arena stuff, time trials. It's all there. It's all there. This game is... And legit, dude, if I had more time, I would want to play this more. Because the mechanics are so satisfying when you're plucking chunks of armor off of like a, a robot animal so that you can then fire a different type of arrow and get like the flammable core and stuff and do fun. Oh, mate. It's always the ones you least expect. Yeah, it's, yeah it's, good. it's good. It's good fun. Mate, what do you want me to do? Why is this still on my map? Review preparations. I have flagged it. Yes, I see dummies. All right, let's go over here. Do you want me to pick this up? I'll pick it up. Is this what you want? Huh. So you must be Aloy then. I thought there'd be more of you. More of me. I didn't realize Pickering, I was supposed to talk to her, sorry. More of a gear wheel, less of a ringlet. Don't get me wrong, you're very well struck. 
Are we dating? While Osirim flirt at the most inopportune times? Inopportune? Battle hasn't even started yet. Petra Forge Woman, I hail from the Free Heap. I'll be heading back in the next dust storm. Free Heap is what they call her bedroom meetings. The arsenal first. Cannons have aged well, but I've cleared their throats so they can really roar. Yeah. Thank you, Petra. I'll let you finish up. Honest metal work is hardly work at all. Look after yourself, flame hair. Hmm. There's another free heap at the club tonight. Get yourself tested. All right, that has done it. Okay, my apologies. I was supposed to talk to her. I didn't know her. So she's obviously from probably a side mission that you get to know. Oh, Bull Kitty. Bull Kitty, thank you very much for the 69 bitty. And that lovely family safe alert. How are you? Love you, Mikey, but I'm off to bed. You and me both, mate. Catch you tomorrow. Yo, I will catch you for the final battle. We will become brave warriors. Cheers for the bitties. Is that an XLR cable around you? Secret Moonshine. This is my budget cosplay. Look, I'm off the Kaja tribe. See my facial markings. Every time I die, I have to add another strip. Yesterday, I was covered. And she so, yeah, it's my, it's my techno... This is my, uh... Um, my audio cable for my electric guitar. But it's, you know, of the colours of the game. I hunted this animal. Wild fleece. Cool. From the go. plains. Oh, yo, dude! Thank you for dropping a gifto! Secret Moonshine just dropped a gifto, landing on our boy Nyx! Yo! Secret Moonshine's just like, Yo, Nyx. Watch out, bruv! Right back at ya. Throws one out to the community. Thank you so much. By the way, this is not a lightsaber. This is a Horizon Zero Dawn laser rapier. A ray pier. Legally distinct. That cosplay got a gift sub because I'm already subbed. Hey, thank you very much, man. Oh, wow. I was just thematically getting into the vibe of the game. But dude, I appreciate that accent. What a handsome man. Bloody hell, mate. Yo, cheers, bruv. Oh. And here I am about to go to bed. So sorry if I feel really guilty. I'm just like, yo, thank you for the gifto. Good night. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Right, let's just go check out these other preparations. We've got another 20 minutes. Let's go. Yo, thank you very much, dude. I hope you have a lovely evening. How many times have you died in Dark Souls so far? Come on, we're all friends here. Come on. Gentlemen's secret. Where? Where are they defending? You can tell I haven't spent too much time around the Sun Palace. Hundred and twenty. No, Bill. No, Bill. Bill. No. We haven't travelled a hundred thousand years into the future and gotten super woke for you to come out of that sort of chat in my stream. A hundred and twenty-four. Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. Hmm. Light town. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to mention anything in Blight Town in case you haven't come across it yet. But uh yeah. It's gross and it sucks. Look at that view. Look at everything slowly loading because the camera's pointing towards it. PS5 mate. Ooh. What a fine kingdom. Look at all that atmospheric effect. This game is massive. Yeah, in terms of really big sandboxes, this is another example of a really big sandbox. Am I here? Yeah. So this is the other location. Oh, this is the spire. Is this the spire? This is the spire! Right, so this is the main location that we need to defend. Because this is where Hades is going to attack in order to send out the signal. 
Yo. Okay, now it's interesting again. Hey, it's my boy. Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. <laughs> she doesn't much like being called anointed either. It means a lot to have you here, Varl. I gave my word. So, Meridian, what do you think? We like Varl. I've seen many new things since I first met you. I should thank you. Varl, what's wrong? You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen, from something I can't imagine. And you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things we are got, tough for you, huh? We ain't got time for that. Thanks for telling me you know I have to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> don't be too hard on them. They only joined this fight because the anointed did it so. Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. Oh. And we must fight a metal devil. So there's there's the no romancing in this, or, but because you say he's kind of like I the romantic the option. It's him or the Kaja guy with the beard. So am I. Mutton chops. Yo, these are my people of my tribe. Got to go to bed. Time calls. One last graveyard shift before you're done with the current job. Secret Moonshine, thank you very much for the raid. Thank you very much for lurking around and chatting. By the way, really quickly, just to answer what you were saying. Yes. What I've realized about Dark Souls is you have to go somewhere slowly, kill everything, die loads of times because you're trying to kill everything, and then finally work out where you need to go. And then the next time you load the save, you realize you can just run the whole thing. Absolutely. Dude, have a bloody good night. Enjoy the last of your shifts. Say goodbye to the old job. Embrace the new flesh of your new future. Yes! Yes! Dude, absolute pleasure touching bases. Have a good one. I'm so glad we talked with my boy again. Now. Oh, I've still got one more person to talk to. Now, let's see what these guys are up to. It rises taller than the highest tree. These oh. cards are in their frilled armor look like turkeys. Yeah, so the, that guy so we just many. talked to, this is his mum. She's awesome. Sona. Warchief, you... you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I do not belong here. I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all. But my place is in the sacred land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my word. <laughs> She always, she always had that kind of vibe about her, didn't she? Okay. Like, you know that holding a surprise birthday party for her is just quite a miserable affair. It is done. You have surprised me. The birthday is complete. Yay. Anyway, thank you so much for defending our city. She's a little bit jaded. All right. Now. Wait, I've still got to talk to someone. Who's over here? Someone down there? No. Oh, who's up here? Ah. Oh, is this mutton chops? So who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. Yeah, this other guy. What here we are. Hey, Lloyd. <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. She's a fun lady. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's going to be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with Oatmeal. it. Oatmeal. Yeah, well, Let's dude, like a... Big. There's a bit of an emotional journey Sounds in it. Like, like our kind of fight. You start... Right, guys? Well, where do they put the vanguard? He's interrupting me. At the front of the line! And why? Steal before iron! And what are we gonna do? Hit him like a hammer till he can't hit back! Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here for Meridian. Alright. And we're here for you. 
Thank you, Aaron. Versa would be proud. Only if we win. So, um, you're absolutely right, Oatmeal. I started off as a bit of an outcast in my own community. And then I had more like, I basically, I saved everybody's lives. And then I became religiously more important to them. So they're happy to do what I say and have my back. This guy we've had an emotional journey with involving his sister and like his enemies. I've recently also saved this kingdom from a coup. So now I'm telling everybody about the real robot god threat. And they're sort of, you know, they're going to do what I say because they all owe me a favor. This tower is a transmitter from uh, the Gaia technology. Uh, and it's going to be misused. Transmitter? I hardly knew her. Now, we have the ability to go to sleep. I just want to have a really, really quick look over here where the DLC begins into the frozen wilds. So I'm just going to pop over to this campfire with a little bit of fast travel. Um, I'll do a quick manual save before we dive in because we might not go very far and we might just wrap up the game tomorrow. Or, depending on the mood, we might try to get in a tiny bit of this DLC as well. Uh, but bear in mind that my copy of the next one comes in the post and we need to crack on. So we'll see what we're up to. Loading. Yeah, let's manual this here. Manuel. So yeah, how do I go further up? Ah, look at these handholds. So I guess if you didn't get the DLC, these handholds might not be here. Or something along that line. Yeah, that's the Frozen Wilds uh, sim symbol. Or the image that came with the logo. So this is brand new territory. Hmm. It really is a case of whether we're going to do this before or after we wrap up the game. Let's see if I can get to that other waypoint and then we'll have a little think about what we're going to do timing wise in our next episode tomorrow. Hmm. More stuff. Thank you. leads to the cut. The Banuke have nothing to offer besides useless mysticism. The Eclipse won't stand idle while you waste time playing in the snow. Return to your desk. Surprised you're still checking up on me. I thought you had moved on. Well, forgive me for still being concerned with the fate of the world. I was thinking. Rost used to tell me stories about the Banuke and their shamans, and how they thread blue cables through their skin. Kind of like someone else we know, huh? So maybe the real reason you want me to stay clear of the Banuke is to stay clear of your past. It's Ooh. not the past that concerns me, Loy. It's the future. Or possible lack thereof. Which is why you should stop prattling and get back to what matters. But as usual, you'll do as you wish. Mm. Touchy. Yo, fascinating. I'm surprised he still had an opinion. I wonder if he's going to be in the sequel. Ooh, that's a brand new enemy coming right for me. It's got purple stuff on it. Fucking hell, Jesus Lord! Whoa, Kiroki! Uh, I gotta get some flame resistant potion in a minute. Where's my flame resist? Drink that, drink that. Okay, lovely. And then get back from the evil tiger monster. All right, we need to work out what we're up to here. Let's get these shearing arrows. Okay, it's weak against shearing and ice. 
Oh, Jesus Lord. Have I just fallen off a cliff? In slow motion. I can't look up anymore. I, I so, there we go. It's, that's the limit of how far you can look up in the game. Yeah, let's go back. Feeling confident. So that's... I wonder if that goes in my thing. That's a brand new DLC monster. Notebook. Machine catalogs. Here we go. A scorcher. It's shaped like a giant kind of Doberman hyena thing. Mmm. And it's horribly quick. It can cover distance horrifically quickly. Run past. Yeah, let's go. yeah, let's go over here. What if I left? What if I just left? Oh. Good to know. Well, that was horrible. Something tells me the machines here are quite high tier. I suspect that, um, as with most DLC, it expects that I've done so many side missions that I'm at a very, very high level. Oh, I could have gone around here. Oh, hunting me. Higher than I currently am. Yeah, DLC Wolf Canis. Um, I'm on the last chapter before the game, you know, says I, there's no turning back. So I'm really just having a look to see what's going on now. Uh, but this DLC stuff is clearly quite a big cheese. Got it. So we'll see what my chances are. He's not going to get up here, is he? Um. Oh, shit. Oh, he's not attacking me. I don't think he can reach where I am. Oh, Jesus! Well, I think I did the trick. I need to go back down here anyway to collect the items I sheared off it. That guy was very tough. He was not messing around. Cool. Cool. All right, let's go back in. I have to run up and around now. That guy was really vibing me. It's kind of funny. Erin and Ursa actually start a coup against the Sun King, according to the comic. Oh, really? Ursa, the, uh... The lady who was standing at the main gun. The blacksmith. Yo. All right. I didn't really get too much time to check its stats. I wasn't sure what was going to work against it. I might just have a quick look in that animal profile again. Wait. Where was I a second ago? I blew it up. Didn't I just blow that up right here somewhere? Wait, where's the, where's the body? Where are my rewards? Who is that? Okay, that's a welcome, I guess. Hmm. Maybe I'm gonna talk to these people and it'll be cool. Or maybe not. Maybe we'll find out in the next episode. Will we continue the DLC or will we go straight to the main boss? Find out then. 
and I'll see you soon. Take care.